Peppers, be in there. Let's get this party stored. Thanks for cooking in the kitchen with Rob. I've got my baked potato. Okay, again, in this video, we are doing the Holy Trinity from Louisiana Plus. I'm doing it as a topping for cod, for fish. So, the Holy Trinity, if you're familiar with it, for Louisiana is, as you can see, celery. Next up will be green peppers, bell peppers. I would assume red would be considered the same. So again, this is just, shoot, this is one stalk, really. Uh, which, thank God, this lasts a while, because I've had this for about a week, my mom gave me. So green, uh, on top of this, green peppers, and then onion. Like I used to say, Justin Williams, I used to watch cooking. From Louisiana, put a little bit more wine on it. Go look him up, YouTube, baby. Everything's on YouTube. Okay, so there's that one. By the way, I did wash my hands before I start this a couple of times. So now I want to take some green pepper. Cut off a piece because I'm not going to need that much. This is just, I'm just making something as a topping for my fish. And as you know, you know what? I guess I need to put that fish in right now first, too, while I'm cooking this. My potato is just about done. I'm doing a baked potato as well, so hang on. Okay, so I just put the cod in the oven, so I'm looking at 15 minutes on that before it's supposedly done. So I have that amount of time to finish up my cooking, or my cutting, should I say. Um, for the Holy Trinity. Now I'm going to add something extra into the Holy Trinity, which is something that everybody likes. And that's why I need to subscribe to smellavision.com because I'm going to add what? What gives you that smell that's so good? Man, I wish a buddy of mine, Doc, was watching this video, man. He could throw down on the cooking. Man. <laughs> I've seen him do some amazing things with so little, let me tell you, especially on the road. Doc, if you're watching, shout out to you, brother. Doc is one of my old riding buddies when I was still riding motorcycles. Let's get the onion. We were with the uh, Highway Riders, a group that we started together. We started another group together, Cycles in Action, CIA, but then we ended up starting our own. Let's use all this onion if we can, not for, without cutting my hand. Okay, garbage is falling, baby. So this is cooking with Rob. Cooking with Rob. A little bit of orange juice. A little bit of vodka in it. I know it's not good for you, but I'm all alone. So I'm going to cook and get a drink. So, there's my holy trinity. This is according to Louisiana standards, of course. Oh, that's gone. So it's, it's bell peppers, it's celery, and it's onion. And I'm going to add one extra thing that everybody should know about. Let's switch to the oven. Okay, so we're over to the oven and the stove. So I am going to add... First of all, well, let me start it up and be very, very careful because my uh, camera is on the back burner. So let me set this properly in there. Oh, well, I like to put the oil in once, once it's hot. My baked potato is ready, but I'm getting ready to put it in too. As a matter of fact, I put it in now. Oh, shoot. I did not measure 15 minutes. So, <laughs> okay, what time is it at? It's 9.04, so I guess I put it in about, I don't know, a couple minutes of, so maybe 10 after. Uh, I need to set my alarm. 
Well, no, let's say 15 after from now, so I'm setting my alarm for 9.15, 9.15 p.m. Nine minutes, let's go. Okay, so while this is heating up, let me go ahead and put a little bit of oil in it, just a little bit, because this oil lasts, and you see it's just a drop, literally just a drop, so. You want a little bit of water, or should I say margarine afterwards. Let's get this, let's get this party started. Okay, onions, celery, green peppers, and then my not so secret ingredient. Which everybody should be using. Okay. this around. I have, again, green peppers, onions, and celery. But, I'm also going to add a little, well, I don't have butter, so I'm using margarine in its place. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Mm, so you get that smell. Okay, let me come down a little bit. I'm going to add the secret. Secret is of the non secret, which is what? Garlic. Yeah, man. Mm. Uh oh. It's not easy. I can't just use this. Mm, I got it. Oh my god. Oh, baby. Smell that? Mm. Let me toss that about because I love And let me tell you something. There's one thing about garlic you can't use too much. You think you had too much? Ooh, don't let me tighten that up. I may not be able to get back in there. Okay. Mm, oh, boy. Tell you something. Oh, oh my God! It smells good. So, thanks for cooking in the kitchen with Rob. What you know? Let me tell you something. Oh my God! Oh, oh, babe. Let me tell you something. Oh my God! That's good. That's good. Oh, baby. And I just want it to be, you know, a little translucent so that you know that it has been cooked. Oh, my God. The garlic is a bomb. Hmm. Okay. So what else do I need now? I did not cook bacon. Ah, should I cook bacon? I don't even know if this bacon is still good. My mom says it goes bad, so. Hey. Looks like bacon to me. What? Okay. So what I'm going to do is. It's just become. Oh my God, garlic smells so good. I'm going to switch it over. I'm going to cook one strip of bacon. One strip of bacon. Oh, baby. It's still good. I don't see any brown or anything. I am blessed with bacon. I am bacon blessed. Look. Oh, my God, that smells so good. I don't need to give me some real butter. I know butter's not good for you, but oh my God, just real butter. Okay, so that's enough. I'll add one 
and we'll take to that to the end. But let me move over the bacon to now so that I can cook this one strip of bacon. Okay. Let me turn it up a little bit. Now what I want to do with this though is I want to give it not only just have that substance, but I want to add a little creaminess to it all. I just decided this spur of the moment. Uh, where is it? Okay. I'm going to use what you saw in my last one. The tejano salsa. Porque es un poquito caliente. Hey, I got two more strips of bacon I can eat in the morning. What? And, oh, I should have recorded my sausage taco this morning. Oh, it was good. Oh, it was good. Okay, so the fish is on for another, let's see, uh, four minutes. So we'll check on that in a minute and cook this bacon and be right back with you. Okay, my bacon is just about done. Mmm, burn crispy beer. What ya know? What ya know? Actually, the oil makes it cook a whole lot quicker. I need a fire. It's nothing like cooking on a fire. Okay, so I started heating the Trinity on the other side, but I've added a Trinity, I've added to the Trinity one more, which is the garlic, and then I added another one, which is tomatoes. Man, you know what? I wish I had some tomatoes from Guatemala. What's up? I need some from Guatemala. So this is my trinity again. Garlic, onions, bell peppers, celery. But I've added a little bit of tomatoes, a little bit of garlic. So on top of that, I'm going to add just a little more. Not butter, but margarine. You want to flip it and cut it off. I know it stopped so with you because I lift it up. It's still warm. But what I want to do is add again the salsa to it. So. And this stuff has some heat. Let me tell you. Now I've already cut it off. Oh my God, that smells good. And any chef, of course, is gonna taste his own work. Oh my God. Oh, baby. Mm. I can't tell you. If you see my videos in Guatemala, now you know the food was good, but you know, a lot of it is, your other senses, just the way it looks, but even more so the way it smells. So, oh baby, now it's turned off. I don't know how far my fish has gone though. So let's take a look. I don't have a name for this. Ross Codfish. Not hot enough. So we're gonna have to take a break, let this sit while the fish cooks and the baked potato warms up and then we'll be ready to go. Okay, so I'm heating up my Trinity plus two. My Trinity? I don't know what you call it, but. So out of the oven, I am taking my fish and which will be my fish and my uh, baked potato. So, 
Let's do this. Let's take the fish. Which is right yonder. There you go. I'm cooking cod, by the way. Cod. And I am going to take a baked potato with it. Oh Lord, I think I almost took my camera, but I've got my baked potato. Woo-hoo! Woo-hoo! Woo! Okay, baby! So, what I want to do is take a knife and split it down the middle. I know that's cooked. To take, let me take my hot uh, some type of glove and popping fresh. Woo! Woo, woo, woo! That's hot. Okay. I'm going to take my potato and let's grab this out of here. And let's put this beside my fish. baked potato. Now I need to top my baked potato too. Okay, so I have my fish and my baked potato and I have woo caliente. And I want to take a little bit of more, let's see, butter and let's add it to it or margarine. Oh! That's hot. That's hot. Let's get this in there and see if I can get this melting right. Okay. Okay. Now, what else do you want to eat baked potato? You want bacon. So remember the bacon strip that I cooked up earlier. I've got my bacon, I've got my butter, I've got my grated cheese. Now you may want to take the grated cheese out of uh, just a few minutes ahead of time too to let it, you know, diffuse a little bit. I really should have put this in the oven with the baked potato on it so I have, I mean with the cheese on the baked potato so that it would have melted a little bit more. But, okay. Trying to make do with what I have and refrigerate what I have, and so I have too much left over. And then bacon, cheese, what else? Sour cream, maybe. Sour cream. That's called a dollop. Dollop, baby! Dollop. Okay, I also want to add a little salt and pepper. First the pepper, then again I am using the Himalayan pink sea salt. Not too much on it. And then, more than anything, I want to get what smells so good in this place. Put my salsa, my Trinity salsa. Oh my God. Now I know it, I had, it had a little bit of heat because it has the Texas salsa on it. You probably can't even see the fish anymore, but it's under there. So let's see what we're working with. Okay, so here is dinner. Baked potato, codfish, with the Trinity plus two. And the only thing, the only thing I'm missing is a fork. And this is what we're working at. So, I don't have a name for it. It is what it is. It's a baked potato, fully loaded. I consider it fully loaded. And codfish with a Trinity plus two. Let's, how about that? Let's call it a Trinity plus two. So let's see. Oh, it's flaky. 
Let's get that sauce with it. Come on. What I gotta do to get the sauce on it? Let's see what it tastes like. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. And the baked potato with the potato uh, with bacon. Oh, you see that smoke? Mmm, life is good. Mmm, mmm. Oh, wow. Now I can cook for one person, but Catherine can throw down. <laughs> this don't touch anything she's ever cooked. Doesn't touch it at all. But for me, this is a 10. Oh, oh, oh my God. This was good. Oh my God, this was good. This was my fish, my cod fish with the Trinity Plus 2 and a baked potato fully loaded. Oh my God, it was good. Oh my God, it was good. Best meal I've made in this apartment. Still can't touch Catherine's food, but best meal I've made in this, in this apartment. Stay with me now. Please comment and share if you liked the video. Please subscribe and kick the bell.